This is Francis, the voice behind the videos in this channel. And my name is Francis, as I said, I'm still a, a student. And I also say I'm a student of life because I'm learning a lot from life. And today I just want to tell you why I'm very active in this pig farming thing. Why I'm actually serious about spreading the message on pig farming. What's my motivation? I want to share with you here today on my on the channel. As you see my face, maybe for the, for the, for the first time, maybe to you. That's the first time you see me. So I want to share with you why I'm making these videos. Okay. Yeah, so my motivation for starting this big channel, big family channel is very simple. You know, I'm a village boy. Yes, let me say that. And after, uh, I, I can share with you on this channel that what made it possible for me to go from uh, stage one to go to high school and then to the university is uh, this big farming okay all right so basically in a big farming took care of him from junior high and then through to high school itself okay so from there it was a family owned a big farm something small and they were only used to take care of their children their family so they can sponsor the education okay so after most of us have completed this uh, High high schools, they decided to quit because they realized that they are they are not able to take or give that needed attention to the pigs as they require. So they decided to shut their farms and then move on to other things like farming crops. So it was during this time that my interest in the farming came back, and I realized that I said no. Once this was what took me to this far, it means there's still hope if I should pursue this. I can also help other people to do it. So that was how I started this. Uh, I also started something small, but like I wanted to educate people on pig farming. But you know, I can't tell people to start it when I don't even have a farm. Okay. So they decided to start something small, like a, I call it backyard. So backyard containing like a maximum of 30 pigs inside. Okay. Eight rooms and I keep 30 pigs inside. And that is how I'm doing it. So with that, I, I'm able to make frequent videos and then tell people, show people that they can actually do it. Because I started this whilst I was in school. Okay. So that is actually. The motivation behind it and through this big family that's like i can share with you that uh, there have been a lot of benefits i have received as a as a a, a, a big farmer myself though i'm not the money is enough for me because i i started this big farm and i gave it in care i gave it in the care of my mother to be taking it because i don't want her to be requesting money for me all the time so i gave it to her okay so in anything i do like as only supervise and then the work keeps moving smoothly for her but in reality it is for her it's her farm I invested it and then I handed it over to her indirectly. Okay, and what I can say and then share with uh, some of my friends and like people of my age meet and then a youth that don't sit down and then say there's no employment. Okay, one thing is if you don't want to look dirty in this part of our world, Africa here, if you don't want to look dirty and you want this office work, you always be hungry. People are in office, but they still come to us who are dating the pig, pig farm that. They need assistance and we have to sell there are sometimes i have to tell my mom to sell some of the pigs and then give the money to a particular uh, someone who is into a professional field give the money to that person and the person will pay within the next three months or six months and i've been doing it okay so i realized that if those people who are in these white colors color jobs are even uh, struggling to make ends meet how much more we there those who are here to start this corporate work so it's, it's better i focus on this big farm thing and before I be able to focus fully on myself, I should be able to ensure that my my mother, who uh, like actually took care of me single-handedly, is really free, and then like she's able to live a comfortable life on her own. Before I can actually focus on myself, so that was how the idea started, and I started it with three. As I shared in this video with you, I started with just three of the pigs. I bought them, and then in total, they were not even up to two hundred dollars at that time. The three were not up to two hundred dollars. They were somewhere uh, 150 140 dollars a year and i started this industry and within uh, two years i've already had a uh, 40 48 pigs from the three pigs okay and from then i decided to sell them and then also put up a, a structure to keep the new ones and then gradually we are moving from there okay but the thing is i'm always, always sharing with you on this platform and i'm doing voice service and then what is holding me behind is like I actually lost uh, my phone and I don't have the right phone to do the videos for you and that is why I, I always do the the videos alone and then I do voiceover on the videos.
planning to get a new phone and then uh, to start making these videos okay so if you see me like i actually want to be in my videos but because i don't have the right set right cameras and the equipment that's why i'm actually using a uh, videos from other phones and then so that do voice over but all the videos you see are uh, all the pictures seen in, in my videos they are actually on the farm and they are long time taking pictures or videos that i have them on my, on my my laptop so i use them there and then i always make voice over to cover up what i want to share with you once i realized that sometimes you go for this uh, big farming uh, seminars and most of the time they don't even tell you what you are supposed to know they say something small and then they leave the rest the bigger part and most important part they leave them out and then for you to go and find it out yourself and you know with that it's going to require you to do a whole lot of research and then it's taking it into your time and at this point people are already there so you can always search for them simple and get it so i realized that once i am into it and anything anything that comes up on a farm i take it as an experience and as an experience i don't want other people to suffer especially if it is a loss i don't want some people to also suffer it so i'm going to make a video on it so that anyone who gets to know it will be able to avoid some of the problems I, I encountered earlier okay so that's what i always make videos relating to my farm and most of the things that i share with you they're happening on my farm and how to took such decisions i've been able to prevent majority of the happiness on the farm so that's why i will share that with you on the channel okay so today if you see my face for the first time that's it i'm francis and i'm making a whole lot of videos and people keep saying the, the quality of the video is low yes i know uh, it actually helps me but i'm working on improving it so give me time and at the right time i'm sure i'll be able to produce the best of it all for you to see